Hey everybody, I'm Shane Mason and this is Mason Boys Outdoors. This morning, I'm squirrel hunting. I got one spotted. I'm just watching, seeing where he goes. When he stops, I'll, I'll sneak up on him. There he goes. Let's go get him. Just shot him down. I just picked up that second squirrel and I fixed my GoPro up for the head mount. And so, and see if we can't get a good video of shooting a squirrel. Got him. Let's go get him. Get him over here. There he is. All right. Got some good bushy tails this morning. All right, guys, we're back at the house. We ended up with five squirrels. I'm going to show you how to skin them out real quick. Then we're going to put them in the crock pot for dinner tonight. Let's take him in the middle of his back and cut a slit. Yeah. Be careful with that, Si. You're going to cut all four legs, his head, and his tail off. I've cut the head, uh, the head, the tail, and the feet off of those four. Still working on this one right here. This one still has a nut in his mouth. And to cut these legs off above the foot joint there, his ankle, Put your knife blade like so and just pull it over and you'll feel the bone snap. And you can just cut it off. Just like that. Sauce, look at this. Look at this squirrel's mouth. Oh, what is that an acorn? It is. Uh, Alright, once you got the legs, the tail, and the head cut off, you split the back like that. You just get your fingers in there and pull. And BBs fall out of the skin. BBs? Yep, BBs from my shotgun. Uh, then you just work the skin off of the off of the head here. Sometimes I see it's it brain. You see it's brain? Sometimes it works out better than other times. But that one was pretty good. Did you see this real brain? No, we didn't cut the brains out, bud. Look at me. Silas? Daddy, stop me. Yeah, quit that. Once you cut the head, the tail, and the legs off, you've already split the back. Get, uh, work your fingers down in there and just pull it out. One will slide off one way and you just work it off the other way. And then you got your fresh squirrel meat there. You'll stick your knife in, a, in the anus right there and split uh, the bone. Then you'll gut it all the way down and pull all the innards out. I'm not going to show you that because YouTube doesn't like that. And then you got a piece of clean squirrel meat that's ready for the crock pot. So put them in the crock pot, put them in there a few hours, and he'll be ready for dinner. And by the way, we have squirrel tails. What you want to do when, uh, with squirrels once you have them clean is quarter them up. All the meat on the squirrels are in the shoulders, but mostly in the hindquarters. 
got a little bit along the uh, back straps also. I'm gonna just leave these in in thirds like this, and then we're gonna we're gonna put them in the crock pot, let them cook down, good and tender, and then we're gonna eat them over rice tonight for dinner. And that right there, my friends, is what we got to work with. I'll put that in the crock pot, and it's gonna be a fine dinner. All right, guys. Now we're in the kitchen. We have our squirrel all cut up in the in the thirds and in the quarters, and we're gonna cover it with tonies. We're gonna put a little more salt and pepper on. We got a cup and a half of water in the crock pot. Get those good and down in there. Tony's in it. Not much. I've got uh, about a handful and a half of onion. Put that over. Alright, the squirrel's been in the crock pot for five hours. Mama's already put the rice in there with it since I've been deer hunting. And we're gonna uh, pull some out and see how it tastes. It was a quick and easy and simple uh, recipe. And we got the uh, squirrel out of the crock pot. It's been sitting in the crock pot for the past five hours. It's a quick and easy and delicious squirrel recipe. The squirrel's tender. You can just peel it off with a bone and um, it's super easy and super good. Squirrel in the crock pot over rice. Always remember, catch a mess and leave the rest. God bless you, and we'll see you on the next video. There's the finished product, squirrel and rice. We're going to try to do this uh, catch, clean, and cook here at Momo's house, but there's seven, but there's seven grandchildren running around, so we'll do what we can.